Alright guys, uh, welcome to episode 3 of my blind playthrough of Majora's Mask. Uh, I've got my buddy Zach here with me, he's gonna do a commentary. More like Majora's ass. No. Alright. Um, you've played this game before, right? I've played this game many times. Okay, so you know what's going on, I really don't. Yeah, like this guy? Explain oh. what's going on, who is he? This guy flies down and I think he hates his home and he wants you to give him title beats in your home. Okay. But he's kind of a jerk, and he doesn't want to like you. That dog just tackled me. Yeah, that dog likes to do that. Is there any way to stop him? Uh, if you hold down shield, he bounces off, I think. Like sparks fly. Oh, well, I'm a deck who's and I don't have a shield. Yeah, no, shield. You haven't tried shielding yet? No. Okay. You know what? No. No, you're just not allowed to shield. Never gonna be allowed to shield. Just don't ever shield. You've done it this long. Just keep it up. So no shielding the rest of the game. No shielding. Isn't that kind of required for some fights? Well, no deck of scrub. scrub. Shielding. Okay. Alright. No, keep in mind, can I even shield you? I've just got my spit on. Yeah, what the Deku uh, scrub does, I mean don't try it because then you'll be breaking the pack, but he just goes down and like a Deku nut. You know how uh, how Link shields with the Hylian shield and Ocarina of Time? Yeah. If you do that with the... It's basically, he just crouches down like that and there's a Deku nut looking thing on top of it. Okay. It's pretty neat. Yeah, you can't get up there. Alright, so I still really don't know what I'm supposed to be doing at this point in time. Uh, I know I'm supposed to be trying to get out to the observatory so I can talk to the dude that knows the stuff. But I don't know... I... I haven't... I don't even know where I am. This is a new area to me just Gener now. Generally, the best way to go about it is just to explore the city. Because, I mean, people can tell you, this is here, this is here, go left, go right, but you're going to have to go in the city so many times that it helps to sort of just figure it out for yourself. Okay. Are there any maps you can get later? Uh, yeah, you can get a clock on that from uh, Dingle, he's in. Uh, is it West? I'm, uh, I'm not sure, I was terrible with the names. He's in one of the sections of the clock down. Okay, that's the town I'm in right now. Yeah. Alright. West Park, yeah, it's not West. It's, uh, I think it's a couple screens over. This kid's one of the bomber kids. Yeah, I think this is the one who tells me that his hideout has a secret hole. Mm hmm. Yeah, this is it. Yeah, you're gonna have to go through quite a bit of stuff to get in there, but. It's fairly easy to evade him. I mean, so is this gonna be like one of those games where I can like just spin attack forward and it's just like another game where you just roll the entire game because it's fashion yeah. and walking? Okay. Mm -hmm. That is your gonna be your fastest mode of transportation for actually a pretty good while. And okay. definitely the most convenient one. Don't don't tell me if I ever get my horse back. I don't know. Uh no, your horse is dead actually. Spoiler alert. Wow. I, I, I don't know if I believe you. You do a side quest where you visit the glue talking. factory? Yeah, okay, <laughs> let's, let's just get back to the video. Yeah, this is uh, huh? Jim. He's a... Uh, he's pretty bala. He's bala? Can't, you can't pop that balloon. See that up there? I see it. Wait, what are you doing? I, I, I'm playing with the keyboard. That's what I'm doing. Yeah, there's, there's your spin. You can shoot. You got your magic. And no, you gotta little hold down a little bit. Less. There you go. All right, now Jim's gonna be all surprised. You gotta go talk to him. All right. Hey Jim. Keep it short. Tattle wants to talk to you. You just walk off. He, he doesn't care. He just walked away. <laughs> He's just like, no, nah, man. This, I'm walking right now. Come on. I'm gonna time to talk to you, Deku Scrub. Are you ready? I'm ready. His bone saw's ready. <laughs> so yeah, they give you the entire night to find these guys. 
Unfortunately, you started a little late in the night. It's already halfway over. Yeah, I'm probably not. But, uh... Well, I mean... I, I can probably find them all. It's like... They're not too hard. I'll let, you, guys. I'll let you wander around. Alright. I figure that, you know, I get a good, you know, view from right there. And I see him, I just, I'm gonna drop off on him. Catch yeah, him. if you just drop him. Yeah, just like that. You gotta... Yeah, just make some sort of contact with him. and he's gonna drop. He's just don't getting talk, away. Don't. I don't think he'll actually go through the gates. Okay. So you can just catch him. Like Alright, okay. There you go. Chase him into a corner, kinda. Okay. So you just gotta find the other four. Yeah, Tattle's pretty irritated. Man, how do you only have seven rupees? That, that, how do I only have four minutes left to find the others? Uh, four minutes is pretty well. That guy doesn't count. That's really... He's the gatekeeper. Oh god. The code is actually the same, like, every time, because it deals with time travel and whatnot. But, uh... Oh, so I could look this up online to get Yeah, through. like, it's totally, like, uh, when I play through, I've... I haven't played this game in a while, but when I used to play through, I just remember it, so I just skip half the thing and yeah. just try to run up and remember what it says. Well, I haven't played this one yet, so I don't know the little tricks yet. Yeah, you can figure out how to do There's this kid right here, just... Not yeah. wanting to be caught. Maybe you should pay attention to him. Instead of. Oh. What is he doing? Get back He's here. mocking you. He said, Look at him mocking me. There you go. He just sort of ran into you. Yeah. He got tired. Like, yeah, I'm just gonna say he caught me. Yeah, the dog's not coming from the game. Yeah, he is chasing me though. He just tried to tackle me again. Remember his own game? He's violent. Do you know anything about those owl statues yet? Uh, no, no, yeah. I think I read one earlier and it said something, uh, about come by whenever I have, like, the sword to prove my worth. Oh, yeah, that never happens. You don't ever get a sword. Yeah. Oh, okay. Just stay dead. You know? Oh. Right. No? Yep. I don't called Legend of Zelda the Detective Scrub's Mask. That's what the game's called. I think you played a different game. Dude, you're running out of time here. Yeah, I really am. I don't know where to find them. Uh, it's kind of bad. Yeah, I'm gonna think that that kid is part of the game. You're already out there. Yeah, I know. I really don't know my way around this town. I see that guy up there, though. I see the kid up on the roof. Yeah, getting in there is a little tricky. It's a little unconventional. Oh, no, the second day. Okay, so I didn't catch him in time. No. You kind of screwed the pitch on that one. Okay. <laughs> They're just ready to go. They don't need sleep. They don't need anything. They High five They're each games. other, alright man, take a shower and meet me back here in 10 minutes. I hate energy like that when I was a kid. I didn't. That's like fun video games. See, this grass just runs away, and I don't quite understand it. But I remember where the first kid's at, so I'm gonna go just go for as quick as I can. Yeah. And I, like... Yep, there you go. There we go. Yeah, that grass you end up finding out about later on. Okay. It's pretty cool, actually. Seems like my emulator can be a crap. And it's actually cool. Uh, day two, it's always raining. So can I come back and grab a chicken and fly like that later? No, because you, you're just the next one. Oh, I don't believe you. He just hid in that box. I, I actually thought that was pretty clever of Nintendo in general. <laughs> I guess if you weren't paying attention, that would catch you way off guard. Not only that, it's because it's just a prop. It's a box. So far, all we've seen is one way of time to pick him up and throw him. That's it. And the fact that they have their own little animation for him getting under it. Yeah. It was pretty neat. It was just a little bit like, caught by him. So there's the guy that I'm trying to also get the property from. Yeah, I 
something from them. I wouldn't really worry about it right now. Yeah, I'm still on a time limit for talking to kids. Yeah. So this is where I found that fairy earlier, so I'm thinking there's probably a kid over here too. Uh, there's not. Yeah, it's not the kind of Yeah, I remember them from the uh, Ocarina of Time. Real lazy one. What are they? It's like Ichiro the Carpenter and Jiro. Yeah, it was something like that. And that there's, the who's this guy right here? <laughs> Do you remember the running man from uh, Ocarina of Time? Is that him? Does it's... he deliver mail now? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. He's just like, man, I, I'm pretty tired of working. I just gotta deliver mail. I just deliver mail. But then when he's still in her mail, he's like, oh man, you need to do that. He's so much. Yeah. There's no escape from him. He's, he's, he's cool. an athlete. He's, he's, he's got his own run. little corner of this game. It's not huge, but it's... I can see the kid over there, and I know there's some way to get to him. I just don't know it. Alright, so this town is really confusing me still at this point. I haven't quite figured out where everything is. Well, that's pretty much what I was saying. It is pretty confusing. There's a kid right there. Do what? That was, that was an easy one. Like I was saying earlier, it's, it's a uh, it's a pretty big town, but uh, you go in it so much that after a few times when you get a pretty good idea of where everything is. But it'll probably be easier once you get the map later anyway. Yeah. We've got about a minute left in this video. Go ahead and wrap it up. Final thoughts. What, what, what should I what should I look forward to? Uh well finding those last two kids first off. And uh I think right after this part you're gonna go through a couple things with some really interesting uh couple plot twists. No, oh he just dropped he, off. He just there. ran off the roof by himself. Yeah, that's one way to do it. I'm gonna get Generally him. one thing you do is you can go inside that building and go up the stairs and come out up there. And there's actually even a decking flower right next to you. You should have seen that. There we go. Got there him. Go. Now there's only one kid left. Let's see. Will I find him? Are you find him for you? Before I the video? I don't know. Please. No, oh, that's the business group. And... Nah, man, I think you're pretty lost. Yeah, I'm not gonna do it. Just, uh, find him in the next video.